Okay, now there's one other aspect of this that I think is a useful tool to me. I'm a, a classical music fan. Okay, what I, I, what I'm, lear I'm learning to play the piano, by the way. Are you? Good for that, you. You, that, you play some Chopin? That, that's been the discovery of, of the pandemic for me. <laughs> so uh, I'm, I'm in the process. I think it's going to take me many years. But I, I'm, I'm obsessed with, with piano and, and music too. I'm sorry that very, I very good. but, but no, I, no, no, I, love, I love music too. Okay, that's good, you know, that's very good. What I can do for landscapes though, what helps me sometimes is to think, okay, so what, what should this landscape be like? Should it be like Wagner? Should it be like the Ride of the Valkyries? Should it be lightning and thunder and, you know, big and drama? Should it be like uh, Debussy's La Mer? A, sea, a scene of the sea and everything is silvery and tranquil and it's all about the interplay of light and moment? Uh, should, it be, uh, should it be like Rachmaninoff? Should it be gushing, beautiful, you know? What should it what should it be like? What should this what should this picture be like, you know? And and then specifically as I'm going through a story from from a place, I want I want to make sure is that I'm doing I'm doing real visual step off in all those landscapes. That if I've done one Wagnerian landscape, so you're you combining know, emotions and reaction right, to different photographs. And in color. So that if I've already done a couple of all real blue pictures, that I, I got to get out of that mode and I've got to have a red picture in there and I've got to have these color, color step off and emotional step off from dramatic to tranquil to peaceful to insightful to all those kinds of things. And it needs to speak to the history and the culture of the place as many layers See, layers of meaning, layers of emotion, layers of, of, of graphic style, all of those things coming into it and yet stay simple and direct. So there's, a, in other words, there's a whole lot of things going on, a whole lot of things in the interplay there. Uh, but I think the, the most fundamental thing is that you really walk out the door in the morning with the intention of doing something wonderful, Fantastic. something something unique and wonderful, and you know, and you don't give yourself, you don't give yourself the uh, the luxury of saying, "Oh, got that." <laughs> you, you know, you know that music analogy is probably the best explanation I have heard on how to approach landscape photography. And I've spoken to many, <laughs> many people. Okay. But, but no, but it, it makes complete sense from a, an artistic point of view. And 